In this video, I'll show you how to fix your Minecraft launcher not downloading from the Microsoft Store. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like as well. We really do appreciate it. And please do make sure this video right until the end to know all the different methods. So as you can see, in this case, I've actually got the install button here. But when I go and press install, it isn't going and working. Um, but you also may have the issue of the install button not even appearing here. So if you're having that problem, then let's go and get into these tricks. So the first thing you want to do is come to the top right and go and sign out of the Microsoft Store. So click on your profile and then you want to go and click on sign out, just like so. And it's going to go and sign you out. And if you also go and use the Xbox app as well, then you also want to make sure you sign out of that and sign back in. Um, but some people won't have that. So I'm now going to go and sign back in. If after signing out and then back in again still isn't working, then it's definitely worth going and restarting your computer. So all you need to do is go and press on the Windows icon and then you can go and press on the power button and then go and press restart. However, you may have already tried that, but it's something basic and easy. Now for the third thing, you need to make sure your time and date is set correctly. So come to the bottom right of your computer, right click on this and you can go and click adjust date and time, just like so. And we're going to go and get these settings pop up just like this. I'll go and zoom in on this for you guys. So just make sure it's set correctly. Mine definitely is. And you can also go and set the time zone as well. However, mine is all set correctly. So that isn't gonna be causing a problem. For this next method, we're actually gonna go and run some repairs and other things to the Microsoft Store. So you're close off of it, just like so. And then you want to go and press on the Windows icon. And then you want to go and open up your settings. So you can go and search for settings, just like so. And we can go into this. So wait for this to load. And then all you want to do is go and click on apps, just on the left hand side. And then you click on apps and features. And here we are, it's gonna go and show you all of your apps. So we want to go and search for the Microsoft Store. So let's go and search Microsoft, just like so. And then scroll down a bit, and then we're gonna go and have the store. And here is the store just here. You can also just go and search Microsoft Store, be a bit quicker. Then go and click on the three dots on the right hand side and you want to go and click on advanced options just like so and it's going to go and take us to our advanced options. Then you want to go and scroll down and first you want to make sure it's fully terminated. So press on terminate and that's going to fully close it. Then you want to firstly go and try repairing it. So go and click on repair and it's going to go and run this thing across here. It's going to do some tests and just try and repair it basically. As you can see the app data won't be affected and then you can go and try and reset it. As you can see, the app data will be deleted though. Um, so definitely try running it after repairing it. And if it still doesn't work, then try pressing reset, just like so. Um, so I'm gonna go and press reset. And as you can see, we're now gonna see this line go across. So after resetting it, once again, try and install Minecraft again. However, if it still isn't working, then you want to go and try this next thing. So come and close off of our settings, just like so. And you want to come to the search feature and you want to go and search something called PowerShell. So go and search for PowerShell, just like so. And what's really important is that you go and right click on Windows PowerShell and go and click run as administrator. You may then have to do a Windows security pop-up where you get one um, and then you have to go and agree to that. And then you need to go into the description of this video and go and copy um, a piece of a command, basically. I'll make sure it's labeled clearly and then you're gonna go and paste it in. It looks something like this and then go and press enter. Then it's going to go and take a moment and what this is going to go and do is it's going to go and fully reinstall the Windows Store. As you can see it's now finished as I can now type another command in. And then once you've done that we can come and close off of the Windows PowerShell and then we can try running the Microsoft Store. So let's go and search for the store just like so and it's now going to open back up. We are going to go and need to sign back in uh, because we've sort of reset things and reinstalled it. And then all we want to do is go and search for Minecraft and now let's go and try installing it and hopefully it's going to go and install for you. If it's still isn't installing, definitely worth getting in contact with Microsoft through their website or another support form. If you found this video useful, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. Leave a like for more. Peace.